Okay, wider tires on our X22R or any other motorcycle. Um, I'm going to tell you now, a wider tire is for looks only. It's not going to improve your performance. Looking at this picture here, you've got your contact patch on a straight road, on a medium turn, and then on a heavy turn. Uh, putting a wider tire on your than what comes stock on your bike is going to cause that tire to fail and you'll see right here yes a wider rim with a wider tire is going to have more traction more contact patch than a skinnier rim with a wider tire it's going to fail all right it's going to cause the, the tire to actually crown because it's going to be fit in the bottom to something skinnier than it has to be and it's going to cause it to crown out on the on the uh, face of it um, showing you here showing it's gonna fail it's gonna fail if you put a wider tire too wide of a tire on a skinnier rim it's gonna fail it's gonna cause it to arc out and you'll have less of a contact patch um, people think you're gonna have more you will have less it's alright to go up a size or two but I wouldn't recommend anything more than that I would really keep it at one size bigger um, so if you got a, a 140, I go with a 150 or 160. If you got 160, you go 170, 180. Um, and then if you got a a 60, you know a 160, 60, um, and you're going fatter, make sure that if you go 170, that you go down to 170, 50, and not 170, 60. You need that reveal because that's the percentage of the width of the tire. Um, these charts right here, the first one is your, uh, they're, well, they're either, they might be reversed. So front or back, these are your maximum tires that you can fit on your certain width of a rim. Uh, pause that if you want to check that out to see what you can fit safely on your bike. Thanks.